want to create a safe environment where they can be with other girls and not have to worry about what the boys think of them so they can really uh, delve in and completely feel free to take advantage of these incredible hands-on experiences that we have here and not feel self-conscious about being good at it. With the help of a $10,000 grant from Dominion Resources, the Maritime Aquarium will be able to offer a Girls in Science after school program to over 100 girls in three Bridgeport schools. The best part is uh, giving them the experience that they wouldn't have normally in the classroom. So we're providing them experiences that they wouldn't get in their everyday lives. Fabulous for us to have boys, girls, anyone engaged in science. Anything with science, technology, engineering, math is, is really it's our business, it's what we do in, in the energy world. So uh, we're happy to, to give kids the opportunity to pursue those, uh, those endeavors hands on. Herring says it's important to educate young girls about sciences because many of them do not see careers in the sciences as a path they can take. We reach 125,000 kids a year with our education programs of all kinds and about 40% of them are from under-resourced schools or under-resourced communities. So Bridgeport is a big target of, of where we serve. So we're very pleased to have Dominion's support to be able to start a program that targets uh, middle schoolers, which is a pretty, um, an important population because the studies show that if they don't get engaged in science in middle school, they're lost. Science is a really important for us here in the state of Connecticut, and we have lots of jobs out there that are related to the sciences. And again, about STEM education, science, technology, engineering, and math is very important. We do need to get girls more engaged in that, especially middle school girls. So I think this is really exciting. The programs will target fourth through eighth grade girls. In Norwalk, I'm Quijerba Crawfee for It's Relevant News.